Hello guys, the DB Grinder here, back at it again with another video, and this time we have Kide AK1D versus It's Avon Hofting, and this is going to be another post Agav replay. Hopping right in, we're going to see AK win the rock, paper, scissors, shoot, and they will decide to go first 40 versus 40. Gotta love to see it. Opening hands, we have Jurisworm, Havnus, Mesty, Nessie, and Mally. Okay, uh, so this card, you know, pretty good in the hand game, the discard. Um, or does it send? Yeah, okay, it sends, it sends, it sends. I was gonna say, I was wondering if you could use that plus, like, a danger, but won't work. They have Scream, Solik, Dibelister, Dark Witch, Jet Synchron, and Planet. You don't really want to draw Jet, because you can summon it from deck off of this engine. Uh, but they're gonna go ahead, and they're gonna go activate the effect, discard itself, plus Mally, go search out Sarcophagus, and then draw one, draw on the Solik. Activate the Sarcophagus, activate Nessie, then hit Solik. Oh, that's pretty good. Draw Mothman, uh, Solik effect, go search out Tear Cash, then activate Mothman effect, uh, discard Druusworm, special, draw Druusworm, then activate Sarcophagus, discard Druusworm to go dump Happy, and then that's two level eight. So special, special out from the graveyard, overlay in the Zombie Vampire, then activate the effect. So both players are going to go ahead and mill four. They mill Scream, Diviner. Oh my gosh, we can summon their Diviner. Oh, that's so dumb. Oh, we mill Shaylin, Trivi Karma, Keldo, Nessie. And we get to summon their Diviner. Wait. Summon, yeah. I was going to say, what? Can you even, like, choose to not summon one of these? You can, okay, okay, you can special one of those. All right. I was going to say, I feel like that hasn't come up in a while. You, like, always take the body if possible. But, uh, so are they also activating Diviner Effect then, I'm guessing? But they're going to go search Solik. Uh, we get to search Planet. We get to put back with Shaylin. And then that's going to summon out Garua. Yeah, Diviner. Go dump Medora. I mean, that was supposed to be on that chain link. Uh, but whatever. Same thing. And then go up in the Baron. Uh, activate the planet now to go search. Search out the Shaylin link off. Go in the cross sheep. Not to where Garua points to though. Summon Shaylin. Discard Havnus. Mill 3. Okay. New chain link. Um, they're going to get Scream. Tear Cash. Havnus. Search Solik. Uh, they said, bro, it's not hard. Make my dragon. Make Dweller with it in Shaylin. Said a little chill testing. Did it, did it take a while? added okay 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 oh because they took a little bit i mean did they activate oh they did activate uh tear cash that's chain link one which is very interesting because you you probably want to mill and then resolve the fusion uh they said make dweller with it banish mally make beatrice yeah and they're they're, they're just submitting defeat there because they get to go for mud dragon uh they can get cross sheep effect to summon back. They could actually use that to summon like Mothman. Planet could pop Shaylin. Shaylin effect could activate. But I don't even know what you do there. Because you just make like a Kaleido. Nah, it's not bad. It's not bad. Because there's no point of going for like dangerous or anything like that. But yeah, they admit defeat. It's uh, taking so long. Don't ask to test if you're going to take ages to do simple stuff. Eat your food, then play. Uh, I, I don't know why they're so salty. It was, it wasn't even bad. It wasn't even bad. It was, it was really like a, you know, a, a quick like twenty-five second thing. I mean, it is what it is, you know. Said, bro, first time playing deck. Why are you so mad? Yeah, probably like first time playing like this build. Said, cause you're boring. Jeez. All right, all right, all right. Going on to the next game though. We're gonna see it's Von Hofting going first. We got Kelbeck, Jurisworm, Foolish, Planet, Magma. Oh, okay, so we do have, you know, two solid hand traps. And then Kelbeck, you know, we don't want to have to use this because having it in hand is obviously better. But if we do get to use it as a hand trap and it's good, then, you know, it can come up. They have Talons, uh, the Hunter Fiend, Medora, Rhino, and Talons. Okay, so this is actually going to be pretty good here because um, we will be able to discard Medora off of this engine to bring out the Dark Witch. So we're gonna add Dark Witch, go main phase, activate the effect, summon, and then send. Send Medora, effect to go set from the deck now. 
And then that's going to set the snake eye, which that gives us access to the jet synchron. We're going to send the dark witch and then bring out the jet synchron from the deck. Okay. Yeah, that's fine. Activate Hunter's Fiend. Banish. Go put back. I was trying to think if there's a world where you normal rhino first, but that doesn't seem very good. Because you're just normal rhino effect, dump tier cash, mill two. Because this card has to... Wait. Oh, they just put it back. Okay, well, the card that they just put back, the snake eye, has to send a face up card. So we wouldn't be able to like set talents and send it. And I was thinking maybe send rhino. You know, then we have a synchro eight set up. It's just not that good though. It's way better in OCG because they have, you know, well, they had, I, I, I don't know, maybe it's banned? I actually don't know. Maybe maybe it just got banned, but I know that they had Pepega Ruler, and that card just says Mill 5, which is broken in tier. Uh, they draw in the Solik there, and the normal Summon Rhino, Effect to go dump, and then that's just going to go dump Tier Cash, activate Tier Cash Effect to Mill. Oh, this card literally just disappeared. Oh, okay, okay, it's back. I was like, oh yeah, nice, DB. They Mill Keldo and Murley. Uh, so Merle can put back to try to make Mud Dragon. They're obviously going to Bistial it. They do have two Shufflers. Uh, it's going to make Talents live. Okay, card, can you stop disappearing now, eh? Okay. Are you kidding me? Okay, well, whatever. At least Merle's not going to disappear now. So they're going to Drew us more in the Merle. And then activate Talents to draw two. And then that draws in the Havnus, Drew a Swarm. Uh... I mean, summon Jerusalem shouldn't do anything there, right? Especially because it's the body that they summoned was Jerusalem. So even if we like Jerusalem send it to make Dark Charmer, then they're just gonna go Jerusalem send Dark Charmer. Yeah, that kind of sucks. Uh, they're going to now go into IP, set Solik, pass. So okay, IP with Jerusalem. Obviously, this can make like SP Little Knight. That card's broken. Uh, they draw Druid Swarm. Oh my god, all these best deals. There's just too many. Battle phase, beat over IP. Main phase 2, activate planet. Planet goes search, grab out Shaylin. And then they're going to activate the Shaylin effect. Discard Kelbeck, special, mill 3, mill scream, rhino. Okay, and then new chain link. We're going to get Kelbeck 1, scream 2. So go search Solik, and then both players mill 5. So this could actually end up being really good for the opponent. Uh, we mill Murley, Mally, Nessie, two more Ash Blossoms. They mill Drusworm, Tear Cash, Kelbeck, Mesty, and Diviner. So then, new Chain Link. Uh, we're going to see just Murley as Chain Link one on this side, and then on their side we're going to see Tear Cash, Kelbeck, and then they said Kelbeck Chain Link two, Tear Cash Chain Link three, and then Keldo Chain Link four. Okay, it's so like obviously they're going to use one of the Shufflers or Drusworm to. Stop the Murley from actually resolving there. Uh, so now they're going to activate it. Put back Rhino, Mally, Murley. Yep. Yeah. I mean, you probably just honestly have to shuffle it. You can't even Drew a Swarm because you need to be able to out the Mally because they already have a level 6 on field and you can't really just let them make Beatrice. That card's crazy. So they're going to go ahead and put all those back, even though it would feel good to like banish a name and get rid of it. Uh, then, you know, both players get the mill 5. They get the mill 2 more because Tear Cash. Uh, so the non-turn player mills Mally, Snake Eye, Magma Mutt, Mally, Scream. Okay, well, I mean, really all he did was hit Scream. So he hit both Mally. Ah, yeah, it's really just Scream at that point. And then they mill Havnus, Tear Cash, and Nessie. So they're going to go Havnus 1, Tear Cash 2, Scream 3, Druid Swarm 4. Uh, then they said, think, can't chain Magma Mutt, it's not a quick effect. Yep. So that's going to go ahead, banish, go search out Solik, and then they mill two, they mill Metanoise, Murley. Okay, they already used Murley effect, but still, it's like now they can Metanoise add back. They can just add back Tear Cash. That's just a body. That's just mill three. So activate, banish, special, and then effect. Uh, then they're going to chain Havnus. It just doesn't even matter, though. We, we have so many Bestials. And, like, they actually have multiple bodies on field now. So, they won't be able to, like, Solix send their only body off field, dodge the best deals. So, they mill Scream, Tear Cash, Ball Drake. But they could also activate Solik and then send Druus Worm and try to get, like, you know, two interruptions through that. Uh, they mill Beast, Madly, Tear Cash. 
Okay, uh, activate beast effect, draw on the Solik, and then Mali effect, banish, go summon out Mali. Now they're going to overlay Mali plus Druswarm to make Beatrice, Beatrice effect, they're going to chain Solik to negate that. Yeah, yeah, you know, in response to the effect, obviously. Then they're going to go Druswarm to Sun Shailin, and then activate the effect, that's their last tier name this turn. And then they're going to chain Medora to put back Shailin, Magma Mutt, Tier Cash. They chain Magma Mutt to banish their Magma Mutt. So then put back. New chain link. Magma Mutt 1. We could also use Planet there if we would like to. We're going to Planet. Pop Solik. And then they activate Solik effect to go search. Grab out Tear Cash. Yeah, it just doesn't even matter because we have Druid Swarm. Um, we definitely didn't need to chain Magma Mutt in response to the Shuffler though. Unless if we have a plan for this, because maybe we want to link it off and go into like Dark Charmer to take um, SP Little Knight. Banishing this off field also seems really good. Like, you know, the first effect of it, like to actually like banish this permanently. And you banish like Merly and Havnus and you have like, you know, I mean, end phase Magma was probably just searching another Druid Swarm anyways. So we're only going to have one more Bestial, but they're only going to have one more tier name. So which names have you used? None. Said you have used all three. Yep, Foolish, go dump Rhino. Rhino effect, summon and defense, discard Solik, go search Shaylin, but we are in main phase two, so it doesn't really matter if it was an attack. Normal summon out Shaylin now. On the summon, activate tier cash. Uh, they are like threatening dweller here. Uh, then activate tier cash effect to go mill. That's going to mill Trivi Karma, Agito, Happy. Okay, so new chain link, Agito 1, Trivi Karma 2, Ghost Search Planet. Both players mill 5. And then they're probably going to mill their Agito here too. Uh, yep, they mill their Agito, but they can't even activate it because the opponent doesn't have enough cards in deck. And I know how this is worded. I know how this is worded. This came up. I had so many people argue with this about me during tier format because it says, or their entire deck if they have less than five. But that means, like, if you mill, like, Agito and Kelbeck and your opponent has, like, let's say seven cards in deck, you can activate both. And then when resolving, you get to mill their whole deck. But if they have less than five in deck, you can't activate those. So, said any effects from you? Nope. Yeah, they already used Rhino. Guido can't be used there. So, now they're going to go Shaylin 1, Rhino 2. So, they're going to special summon discard Solik, which they've already used this turn. So, they're not going to get that effect to search. And then put back 3, summon out Kaleido Heart. Rhino 1, Kaleido 2. Rhino's going to get the dump Havnus. Kaleido spin back. Rhino is banished. Yep, because it was... Dumped off its own effect, or summoned off its own effect, and then they dump Havnus, Havnus effect, put back itself plus Mali, and they said, wait, I'm going to change Druid Swarm, and they're going to try to get rid of that, but they said, sec, you used Druid Swarm. Did they? Um, am I dumb? Did they chain it? No. The first one was definitely not in response to that. I don't think the second one was either, right? These were just to stop tier names. I don't think they've used Druus. Not this turn. Let me check log. Yeah, they, they definitely didn't. Yeah. They summoned Magma Mutt this turn. Yeah, so now they're going to get rid of that. You know, getting rid of another tier name. But getting rid of the last name this turn, which is really huge. Uh, that, I mean, obviously right there, they were looking to either make Mud Dragon or Dangerous. Mud Dragon would have been bad either. And it also would have made Mally live because they were putting the other Mally back. And they also pretty much, like, they would know their draw because they would know everything else that's in the deck. Beatrice plus Druid Worm make SP Little Knight. SP Little Knight, Chain Link 1, Druid Worm 2, Send Tear Cash, Banish Kaleido Heart. So is the last card in hand known? No. Uh, it is not. It is not because they... They scream search this turn, right? I know, okay, I was going to say, I know they don't have one in Grave, but they definitely did. But yeah, 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 they, they definitely scream search for Solik, but then they discarded Solik for Rhino, so this is an unknown Solik. End phase, grab back Druid Swarm off Magma Mutt, pass, they draw into the, uh, you know, Hunter Fiend, which they can still activate and just add back from the graveyard, the Dark Witch. So activate that, add back, 
Uh, they, oh, that's actually cool too, because you can activate this to draw one, and it puts it to the bottom, it doesn't shuffle, so then we can draw into whatever we put at the top, uh, which I'm pretty sure was Shaylin, right, because we put that one back first, no, we put back Rhino first, okay, well, there we go, we get to draw that, activate planet now, try to go search out Shaylin, then, I mean, why are they thinking so long? Huh? Did, did the did the replay just stop working? What? Okay, we just we just have to refresh. We just have to refresh. What was that? What was that? I I don't think I've ever seen that where it's like no indication of the replay stop working. It just literally stops working. That was crazy. Well, you know, I, I wouldn't hate you if you skipped ahead like a minute to get caught up in everything. Uh, but that's just crazy. Why? Why? Why has DB been so bad with its replays recently? But honestly, it's fine because there's like a lot of new stuff going on. I know there's like a whole new like remote duel thing going on where there's like a rating for it and stuff. So hopefully this is going to give DB some more competition because that's what DB needs. DB needs real competition. Like, Master Duel is not competition. They're, they're not the same game. You know, this this is like TCG, Edison, GOAT format. Uh, you know, Master Duel doesn't have that. They don't have any of those. So, it's literally just like whole different games. They're not, they're not, yeah. I, I, and hopefully, like, the remote duel thing works out well. So that way, DB has competition. Um... But, yeah, I mean, this is just, you know, gameplay that we all saw, like, 30 seconds ago. No point of really talking about any of this. Yeah, they're playing Shadal Beast, just the one Shadal, it looks like, you know. We haven't seen the Hollow yet, which is the one that we've been seeing more. Especially, we saw them even playing uh, Shyama, the Hollow, and the Phoenix Rhino Warrior, which was pretty cool. But okay, we are almost caught up now. We are fairly close. We're like 25 plays away. It's actually crazy how much gameplay went on in this one turn. There was a lot. Like the game one was eight minutes. And before we even left the game of this one, it was like 25 minutes in. So it was like 17 minutes. But, all right, yep, go ahead, search, they mill. Like, my God, I wish DB didn't have to mess up like that. That That is one thing, though, because, like, I feel like you would, like, never see a Master Duel replay do that, right? Or, like, a, like a YGO Pro replay. I feel, like, I feel like you'd never see that in one of those. Or at least I haven't seen it in one of those. I mean, it's probably happened, you know, bugs happen. But not often, not often. But, okay, here we go. All right. They went ahead and added back. Let me just start doing the next play technique. So then they put back. They drew. Actually, okay, let, let them do planet because this is where it happened. Okay, yep, go search out Shaylin. So it really did just stop working with no indication. That's crazy. I pressed next play. I pressed fast forward. But they're going to special summon by sending the planet. And then go battle phase, beat over SP Little Knight, or at least attempt to. You know, this can only activate if your opponent activates a card effect. Um, so they're going to go Solik on Rhino. They said make Kaleido, pop one, spin one. I have said okay. I don't think sending Shaylin is correct. Um, They're going to send Tear Cash instead of Shaylin. I guess they still have... Two shufflers in deck, one name. Uh, is there is there something else? I'm gonna say, I mean that's fine. Then that's gonna get beat over. Said now I'm confused, but okay. Yeah, I don't know. Sending Shaylin was pretty solid, but I guess maybe they were just really trying to play around a Bestial as the last card or something. Jet Synchron, discard, try to special, they said okay, not chaining in a Shizu there, and then normal summon out Shaylin, activate Medora effect, banish, put back Rhino, Murly, Rhino, uh, so, you know, their Rhino, our Rhino, and Murly, 
and then we can get planet effect yeah and then we can get planet effect that's gonna pop their Shaylin, and then they're gonna activate the effect but we're gonna change Jerus Worm and that's gonna take out the third name so now they're not gonna have any more tier fusions going on we know they don't have crime in their deck we know everything that's left in their deck so they're gonna go into the Dragite, you know, tier cast. It's always a water in your graveyard. Sometimes you have Rhino Heart here too. Uh, now activate Talons to take. So take the Shaylin. That's two level fours. Yeah, that's just two level fours. Go into Abyss Dweller. Pass. Oh, it feels so bad though. Feels so bad. They draw Heartbeat. It's actually not that bad though. But it is. It is. It actually is really bad. We know our top deck too. We can activate Dweller. We actually let them go to main phase. That, that's wild, right? Because what if they just went like... Link these two off in the Dark Charmer. And then go Jerusalem Effect, Send Dragite. You literally just lose. Because then it doesn't matter if you Dweller. Because then we can go Dark Effect to go take... And you kind of just win from there, right? Because they're on, like, nothing. Like, actually nothing. Like, literally not even, like, a body on the field. They're going to go Dweller Effect on the attack. Uh, so they get beat over. And then pass. They draw Snake Eye. Beat over Magma Mutt. Pass. They draw Murly. And then, yeah, the opponent just submits defeat because they know they can't win this one. Uh, it's not going to work. Uh, no matter what they do, they honestly they could just get decked out, but they can go like normal Merly here in its game, and they just mill and win. You don't even have to hit very good. Actually, you do, yeah, because you won't be able to. Well, I guess it doesn't matter if they stop it, right? Because if they use Dragite to stop this, then you get the effect of Surge. You just win anyways. Oh, we could also start with Heartbeat, and then if they don't stop it, then we get Merly effect. That's just game. There's too many ways to win. Uh, don't have enough cards to outgrind. True. They don't. Well, they don't have any tier names to outgrind. It's just not going to work when you have zero tier names. But the match is going to be 36 minutes long. Yeah, the game one went fast, but the game two was actually very solid. Um, yeah, I want to get more tier matches. I don't want to get as many tier matches as I've been doing, though, just because I've been uploading a lot of them. Uh, but I do think it is good to talk about, like, the new stuff in this and, like, the different packages that are being played. Like, I think the Horus package for Tier is, like, I don't want to say solved, but, you know, it seems like this is way better than we were before. Just playing the one of this, one Sarcophagus, and the three in Mesty. Uh, then there's also, like, the Dibelister package, which is just, like, the one of this, the three Rota, the one Snake Eye, and then the Jet Synchron. So there's like different packages that you get to play, and like new different packages that you could play in the new format. Uh, but then you also see a build like this, where you know they're they're not playing these new cards. They they don't need to. Uh, you know you don't have to play them. But I mean, well, I mean this is a new card, but not in the like new engine. Uh, but of course you're gonna play SP Little Knight. This card's crazy. And with all that being said, the DB Grinder signing off. Peace. Have a nice day. Stay safe.